this is mtg welcome to this video in this video i just want to show you how to fund your binance wallet with some fiat currency if you do not have a binance account yet you can use the link below this video to register your binance account and complete kyc and download the app so on my smartphone you can see that i already have the binance app so i will just launch the binance app in order for me to be able to fund it with uh, south african rents because i am in south africa so after launching your app just go to portfolio and then press the deposit button and then a press fiat because you want to fund it with fiat in this case and you're going to have a list of all the fiat currencies that you can use to fund your account but again because i am in south africa i will scroll down to south african rent and press it and then this page will load allowing me to link my account with my binance account so in my case i've already done that but i have selected linked payments and then click on continue so if you haven't yet uh, linked your bank account with your binance account uh, you would have an option to do so so in my case i have already linked one of my bank accounts but if i want to add another one i can just press on edit account and then I click on link account via stitch then you're going to have a list of banks that you can link your Binance account with. If you are banking with, for instance, FNB, Capitec Bank, all of these banks here. So let's just say this time around, I want to link my Binance account with my Standard Bank account. So I can just select Standard Bank. And then here, you need to enter the username or email address and password that you use to um, that you use to uh, to log on to your bank app so you would know your username and email address that you use to log on to your bank app so you need to put that information here so just enter your username or email address and the password that you use when you are logging on to your bank app and then just press on log in once you have done that that means that you would have uh, connected or linked your bank account with your Binance account so once you have done that then you'll be ready to go ahead and fund your Binance account with your um, South African rents if you are in South Africa. You can also do a bank transfer, but personally, I prefer to link my account so that it's easier for me to do that. So I will just press on continue to fund my Binance account with my link bank account. So uh, and then you specify the amount of money that you want to fund your Binance account with. In my case, I'm going to use 350 and then press continue. All right now, as you can see, it says now deposit order submitted and you can rate the experience if you like it. And then you can just go back to your wallet to view the balance and then click on portfolio. When you scroll down a bit, uh, your money might not uh, reflect instantly uh, under South African rents if you are in South Africa. But if you refresh your um, Binance uh, app and you go down a bit, you would notice that now I have South African rents uh, worth three fifty there, which is about nineteen dollars if you convert it into South Af I mean, if you convert it into into dollars. So basically, that's how you can go about funding your Binance account with South African rents or with any fiat currency that is available on the list that you saw previously. So I hope this video has been informative. In my next video, I will show you how to go about. Uh, buying cryptocurrency with fiat currency that you would have uh, sent from your bank just like I have demonstrated in this video. Thank you for watching and bye for now.